My name is Liam Byrne. I am a singer and songwriter and entertainer from County Wexford. Um, I'm probably best known around the country and further afield uh, for my show Ordinary Man, a tribute to Christy Moore. You hit the ground, everything was going to plan. The weekend at well, apart from my tribute to Christy, I also do wedding and corporate entertainment. As a solo singer, I specialize in small to medium sized weddings. My wedding show is a two and a half hour session where a bride and a groom invite their family, their close friends to just a wonderful session. What makes my show different than I think any other act's wedding show, it's personal, it's fun, it's lively, it's filled with songs that everybody knows. But it's also got a spattering of songs that nobody knows because they're my songs, but they're funny, they're a good crack. And when everybody is after dancing for 10 or 15 minutes and they've sat back down to have a drink, I come out with a song like Living in a Field in a Volca, which is a parody of Ricky Martin's Living La Vida Loca. Oh, she would wear you out, living in a field in a Volca. All her sheep had foot in mouth, living in a field in a Volca. And everybody has a good laugh, or I come out with what I consider to be Ireland's greatest love song, because the wedding and love is in the air, and I will sing the ballad of Miriam O'Callaghan, and it's a good laugh. I love you, Miriam O'Callaghan. I'd love you if you lived in a caravan, if you grew a beard and joined the Taliban. I'd still love you, Miriam O'Callaghan. So when everyone's done the laugh and they've had a drink, I go back into Pretty Woman or uh, Suspicious Minds and everyone's out dancing again. So that's the kind of stuff I do when everybody is not dancing and everybody is tired dancing and bones are aching and your ass is quaking and I kind of change it completely. And that's what makes my show a little bit different than the average show. To be asked to be the entertainment for somebody's wedding is a big deal. And I genuinely feel that I have struck up this a relationship before I've even met them. And I generally don't meet them until the day of the wedding unless they would kind of want to meet me beforehand. It's just a great atmosphere. And that is what I try to create, an atmosphere. What also makes my show different than any wedding show, I start when everybody is settled in, ready to go, and God knows when I'd stop. But they know it. My name is Luca. Last night in Waterford, I played for I shouldn't say this, but I played for four and a half hours, which is why I'm hardly able to talk today. But it was a wedding gig. I'm never going to play for these people again. It's their special night. So you give it your all. You give it as much as you can. And when you leave, when you're driving home from playing for their wedding, you know you've done a good job. You know you've given them a great night's entertainment. And that's what they book you for. And that's what I try to do. And that's what I do do. Back to me, mommy again. The weekend that we spent in, or the weekend that we spent in, it was the weekend that we spent in Amsterdam.